Hello everyone. Welcome to Akila's Insights channel for lifelong learning. Thanks for liking, commenting, sharing and subscribing the channel. Today we will discuss about a very important topic, B-Form project in 8th semester. That is the last semester of the B-Form course. Before getting into the channel, if you are not subscribed to the channel, please subscribe and press the bell icon. So only if you press the bell icon, you will get the notifications whenever I upload the video. It is mandatory that all the students should undergo the project under the supervision of the teacher or a guide. And after successful completion of the project, they have to submit a report. And now the question arises about the area of the project. It is a topic or the title. So it should be related to any one of the elective subject which is opted by the student. And the project report shall be submitted in a triplicate. That is a three copies typed and a bound copy not less than 25 pages. The student has completed the project and uh, prepared the final uh, report and now what about the examination? So it is the internal and external examiner will be appointed by the university and the examiner, both the examiners will evaluate the project at the time of the practical examinations conducted for other semester students. And uh, the students will be evaluated by the examiners in a group for four hours, so approximately 30 to 45 minutes for each student. Initially in the video, I have mentioned about the area of the project, that is the title or the topic from which the project has to be uh, undergone. So now if you see in the syllabus, it has been mentioned very clearly that about your elective subjects. So you have around uh, nine elective subjects namely pharmaceutical marketing, pharmaceutical regulatory science, pharmaceutical lens, quality control and standardization of herbals, computer aided drug design, cell and molecular biology, cosmetic science, experimental pharmacology, advanced instrumentation techniques. So from this you can select your topic as per your will or due to the strength whether it has been allotted by the Lord system by the college. At this point, students will have many doubts. So, how the evaluation system? Still more, you will have a lot of doubts about the evaluation or the assessment. Because internal and examiner is there like all other practicals which you have uh, undergone till seventh semester. And now, how will be this evaluation? And uh, this evaluation is uh, divided into uh, two parts. One is the evaluation for your dissertation book. That is the report what you are preparing. Because the report has to do, it is a group, the report has to be prepared individually. And now, the other part, first part is about the evaluation of the dissertation book. And the second part is about your presentation. Which means that you have to be ready for the presentation and you have to present it before the internal ex external examiners. So now let us see about the evaluation of dissertation book. So the total marks awarded is 75 out of which so there are four criteria. Objectives of the work done carries 15 marks and the methodology which you have adopted that carries 20 marks and the results and discussions carries 20 marks and finally the conclusions and outcomes carries 20 marks so totally you are having 70, 75 marks so your dissertation book will be evaluated for 75 marks now coming on to the evaluation of the presentation so the same way like how the dissertation book is evaluated so you uh, also have 75 marks for this and there are three categories on which the marks, is, marks are allotted the first criteria is presentation of the work that is 25 marks and communication skills is 20 marks and the Q&A the discussion and answer skills carries 30 marks and the total awarded marks is 75 we discussed about the evaluation of your dissertation book and your presentation now what about the allotment of marks you know that it is 75 marks and 75, 75 plus 75 150 but so how the allotment will be made 
there is still more uh, the uh, some uh, clarity is required that is the 75 marks assigned to the dissertation book will be same for all the students that is suppose uh, a book that is a dissertation book is been awarded with 60 marks so all the students will get 60 marks whereas when it comes uh, uh, with respect to the evaluation of your presentation it will not be the same because the presentation depends on the individual students suppose five students are there in a group five students will their presentation might differ so their marks also will differ so now the students have to understand very clearly that so they have to they, their marks will vary in the presentation what they are doing but their marks will be same in the during the evaluation of the dissertation book and here if you see in the 8th semester you have two main subjects two elective subjects and also you have time allotted by the bci pharmacy council of india for your project work that is 4 hours a week so you have main subjects to which carries a separate uh, hours and two electives you have and that also carries some hours per week and for project work alone you have four hours so this uh, the students have to utilize this time every week of this time and uh, you have to do a better work not like simply uh, you are copy pasting whatever the informations are there or it is since it is a group so you can just uh, do your work so let's not be not that the students have to utilize this time to increase your knowledge and also to find out your interest that is your future interest so this might help you to choose your career hope you have got a clear idea about the projects which has to be undergone in the 8th semester okay and now if you have not subscribed the channel please subscribe the channel and if you like it to like and comment and uh, if you require any other informations re related to your topics that is the area of your project or whatever it is you can mention in the comment and then i can explain you in the another video thank you